Hello again and welcome to episode number 5. In this episode, we will look about how to include the LCD in our projects. First of all, I'm using a 16 by 2 LCD. We will hook it up to this big microcontroller as seen in this uh, very famous schematic online. Just an example, uh, we will use the 4-bit method, not the 8-bit method. And the rest of the circuit here is exactly as our previous uh, tutorials. So going here to our code, first of all, we will use this lcd.h uh, famous library that is found online and I'm gonna link it in the description to add it uh, here you go to header new other then you choose C and C header file then you name it LCD and paste everything in it and save it we'll get back to the main uh, thing here the main dot C we will define the crystal and the configuration bits as exactly as uh, the previous episodes but here we will include this lcd.h that we have in our uh, project then uh, I'm, I'm gonna include this library although it is not recommended or uh, I'm sorry it is not uh, necessary for this particular tutorial but we will use it in the further tutorials so it doesn't uh, hurt if you put it starting the main with defining an integer then making it rest d or port d as output then we will start using the library by initializing the lcd then clearing the LCD and after that we will int, uh, get into our loop it is very simple as an example first we will clear the LCD then we will uh, use this command to assign the cursor to line number one pin uh, or letter number one the very first letter or the very first line we will write thundertronics make sure it is uh, 16 characters or less depending on your LCD then we will use LCD set cur cursor to line number two and uh, position number one. We will write electronics plug and we will wait three seconds. Then we will clear everything and write welcome to pick microcontroller course. So without further ado, let's uh, push the, the program button and we'll see how it is going to be in the practice. So let's get going. All right, everything is set up now, and I have written Thundertronics on a previous episode or previous project, but now we will try to program our uh, current program. So I press download. It is now downloading uh, the software and configuring memory, program verification complete, and as you can see, it is now exactly as we have written, three seconds, then welcome to Pick microcontroller, electronics blog, etc. etc. Welcome to Pick microcontroller course, three seconds, thundertronics, electronics blog, and it keeps repeating uh, after one another. Uh, now, of course, nothing is fancy in here, just the exact same uh, circuitry that I have explained, beside the Pick 3 that you guys already know how to use from the episode before that. So, uh, and my power supply, five volts. So um, right now, uh, this is our very basic stuff, but starting from episode five, we will look into analog to digital converters and we will start looking into the internal uh, modules and uh, uh, filters, uh, or I'm sorry, internal modules and uh, features of this big microcontroller such as the capture, compare, PWM, analog to digital conversion, slave, parallel port, etc, etc. So uh, stick with it and I'll see you in the next episode.